Hey guys, this is Jeff with Coxman, and uh, I'm going to recap war number 12 for you real quick. Um, it's not over yet, we still have an hour and 39 minutes left, but we're up by 8, and they have really no attacks left. Um, all low guys, except for their number 3, who couldn't even star our number 3. So, uh, not too worried. Um, they did do a decent job on our top guys. The one stars in there are definitely killing them, but uh, we'll go through it. I'm going to show you three attacks again. I'm going to show you our attack on number one and number two. And uh, I'm going to show you number eight. Yep. This is uh, a Go Weaver, I think. Um, Golems, Wizards, Valks. Um, did throw a balloon in there to take out the bottom cannon. But uh, it was a nice three star against a, a pretty decent Town Hall 9. Uh, Actually, I'll take that back, kind of a low-level Town Hall 9. But uh, as you see, it'll go a nice 3-star. Definitely helped out a lot. <clears throat> Starts off at the bottom. With the loon, a couple whiz to clear out a couple buildings. The main thing with Valks is you want to go right to the center. Uh, he does use a jump and his heal. Two heals and his rage with the Valks. <clears throat> Go the Valks, there's a jump to kind of bring them right towards the center, which is perfect. Rage to make sure they get through the CC, Tesla's and Expo's nice and quick. Then he throws uh, his heroes and CC of witches up top. It's kind of like a go wee wee they. <laughs> I don't really know what it's called, but you guys can call it whatever you want. King lost a lot of health early, but uh, I believe he makes it all the way through to the end. Valks are still doing work. Golem still uh, still at full strength over there. Queen's almost dead over there, but uh, he's gonna rage it in a second. Yep. <clears throat> Ton of troops left, only that archer tower left, so it was a nice and uh, easy three star for Patriot. Good job. This was a very ugly war for us, as you can see. We only three stars, most of their town hall eights. Um, I was pretty nervous throughout the whole thing, but we did pull it off. Now I'm going to show you Go Wipe by uh, Derek Wins, a.k.a. Dave. Uh, hold on, I'm going to go back real quick. Me and Dave are the two top, two top Town Hall 10 hitters that we have, so uh, we both agree that we always like to pull the CC. So right there he sees that he's got a little bit of room. It does bring a couple of wall breakers just in case he has to break through to actually get the full pull. But um, this is a, a low level... Town Hall 10 hasn't done his, his Archer Towers or his Wizards Towers or his Cannons, so it's really like a Town Hall 9 with Max Expos and Max Infernos, which uh, can definitely be a problem. So Dave pulls right there, he throws his two Giants. Uh, and CC's already pulling, he does waste a few Wall Breakers, but still managed to pull off the 2 star. Gonna pull him out farther with his two barbs, which is so slow, it's annoying. <clears throat> Throws a CC down with the witches in it to take care of their CC. Drops his golems nicely. He's already broken that wall, so now he just has to break open this wall. He used uh, four P.E.K.K.A.s on this one, wanted to use more of a force with that single Inferno, just in case a couple of them were taken out. A little late on this hero drop, but helped them definitely get the 54% on this one. Nice jump to the middle. Oh, those little skellies are so annoying. Raises 
the Signal Inferno. <clears throat> I believe he freezes it again right after. Yep. Queen taking care of the CC. Still got his three Pekkas in there. Kind of going stupid because of the King down to the left. Wraparound bases can be sometimes annoying, so. But. Nice and easy uh, <clears throat> two star and a decent Town Hall 10. Nice job, Dave, as always. I always get stuck with the task of uh, attack, attacking the other team's number one. You know, this was probably by far the best one that I've seen in a while. Um, this base gives me a lot of trouble with Go Wipe, but went a little bit heavier myself with my troops. Used three golems instead of just two. <clears throat> and uh, what was nice that I could definitely pull a CC up there, which really helped out a lot. So I'm going to pull it with uh, three giants, and then I'm going to drag it down to the far right. And I decided not to come in from the top, which I usually do. Because of his walls, I didn't want my guys to get stuck on him and then get destroyed or pulled down once they got to the center by the hero. So you'll see I come in from the bottom, and I use three freeze and two rage. Here's my pull with the three giants. See a lot of whiz and a, lot, a witch in there, so. Kind of easy pull. Probably didn't need all three, probably only needed two. But I'm going to use the six barbs to really pull them all the way down. Again, the witches take forever to pull. I have two gallons of my own, and I do have a max one in my CC. Drop the first gallon. <clears throat> Don't really care what happens to him. He dies real fast. <clears throat> then I drop my other two to the side where I'm going to be attacking from. But got rid of his CC with my whiz. I'm going to spread some wall breakers out to make sure that I get the pull or get the breakthrough. Uh, drop my king, Pekka's queen. Use my first rage as soon as uh, I get to their heroes. So all my troops are down except for three whiz right now. Uh, I freeze the Teslas, figured he had the other two there as well, which he does. Took care of his uh, heroes pretty quick. I'm going to drop my last two freeze here on both sides. Get in my last rage as well. So, Pekka's take care of that town hall nicely. <clears throat> Queen's still at full health, but you'll see in a second she gets pulverized once they take care of that Pekka. So, Rager. Got the 50% with my Queen. Did have one whiz left, which I threw up top. Hart was definitely racing on this one. <laughs> Very close two star on a Town Hall 10, but managed to get it done. Got some nice uh, war loot coming to me once we win. Get an hour and 30 minutes, but it's over. Thanks for watching. Have a great day and clash on.